How's it going, gamers? My name is Vast Game Master. This is Valkyrie Chronicles 4, a new game that just got released today, September 25th. This one took a while to download. I don't know why, but I bought it the day, like the night before it came out, and it had it preloaded and everything, and it still took like over five minutes. So enough chit chat. Let's get straight to the game. The day our hometown burned, that was the day we enlisted. At last, we had something to believe in, something worth fighting for. None of us yet knew, we couldn't foresee, what this war would cost us. It was a battlefield, but it was where we grew up. I love his haircut. Wind out of the northeast, clear skies. And, uh, 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 huh? Nap time's over. Come on, Raz. I wasn't napping, just resting my eyes. You gotta relax, man. You are way too freaking tense. Your hands are shaking. <laughs> so sack up, Commander. It's about time we get ready to roll out. Let's show those imps what's come to them. Yeah. Shift in the wind. There. Huh? You getting those wind whispers again? Imperials incoming! All right, boys! It's go time! Squad E! Do you read me? Squad E! This is Commander Claude Wallace. Squad E! The Imperial forces are on the move! Heading for your position! Ready to engage. Do not let them break through to the front line! We're counting on you! Roger that. Over. Good luck, Squad E. They won't advance until they're done shelling the area. We should have time to prepare. Kai, take a group to that southern hill and slow down their left flank. Raz, take two soldiers east and make some noise for me. You got that? Gotcha. Keep up or get left behind! At your command! Hoffin, roll out! Squad E, ready to engage. All right. Just remember your training. We can do this. Already off in a good start. Eliminate all Imperial hostiles. Let's stop their advance. Squad E, move out! All set, Raz? Okay, there's one thing I need to get clear. This is my first time ever playing a Valkyrie Chronicle game. But, I did watch a YouTuber play Valkyrie Chronicles, uh, the first one that came out on Steam. So, I am vaguely familiar with the story, and I know what's going on so far, but this one's entirely different. Just say the word, boss. I'm locked, loaded, and in freaking invincible. Let's test that, shall we? Okay. First, we'll see how they respond to some infantry. Squad E, move out. Okay. Looks like everyone's in position. Finally, it's time. I'm their commander. It's up to me to get everyone out alive. 
concentrate. Remember your training. We can do this. I can do this. When combat starts, you'll see a map of the area and your unit's position. This is referred to as command mode. Basically, it's not all that different. Okay, cool. Got it, he's here. Now attacking. First, we had this. And I could just switch targets. Wide open! I should have expected as much from you. So we'll just end the action here. Damn it, these assholes are in my way. I can't break through this. Why not? You're invincible, right? Yeah, exactly. Are you really getting tripped up over some common foot soldiers? Why don't you ever stop and think? Oh, shut up! Just hurry and take them out, will ya? Thought you'd never ask. Damn. This won't take long. Okay, okay. Well, let's put the gun down. Let's talk about it for a bit. Moving out. I get to play as a girl sniper. Nice. Normally, you wouldn't shoot at the head, but screw it, it's just a game. Please tell me you did not miss. Okay, I am pretty much... Well, I guess that's it, I can't do anything else, really? Or am I just stupid? Moving out. Well, let's try this again. There we go. This time I'll aim center mass. How are you missing? All units, use your best judgment. Uh... Alright, well. Well, no, not really. I haven't killed anybody with her. I guess I have no choice then. There's just more troops spawning in, that's all it is. At least he's in cover. I I kinda wish I had her like ducked down somewhere. Here we go. About time, Claude. Yeah, I know. Soldiers, forward! Now's our chance to take the offensive. Back up has arrived. Yes. Now advancing. Let's try her again. Handbags. Oh. Alright. Basically, I already figured that out. Let's see if she could hit this one. There you go. I should have expected as much from you. And we'll just end the turn here. And then we got some guys on the open. Hey guys, check this out. You've been spotted. Watch out! Just 
uh, let's see, these guys are scouts. Understood. Let's be. How's this? That's too far away. I got this. Right now, their position sucks because they're standing, they're getting flanked right now. Check which way the enemy's facing. Let's see if we can hit him. Die! Just barely. Alright. Yeah, I have no more, so... Oh no, don't let him flank you. Come on. There you go. Somebody got him. Oh shit. Busting out the tanks, huh? This one's all yours, Claude. It's our turn now. Fire up the engine, Miles. Yes, sir. Okay, the Hoffman's moving out. Destroy the enemy tank. Now we're getting into the fun stuff. Oh, so you can destroy those. Cool. Probably move you out of there. Minimal damage. I'll do my best. Let's get you somewhere. Gonna use the old World War okay, moving out. well pretty much the mechanized tactic of He's already got AP rounds selected. So Fire. Oops. There you go. How does the Federation side look? Got this. See if we can move you out of the way. Yeah, right here would be good. Alright, that should be it. There's nothing else for me to do, really. Understood. Let me see if I can move her or him. I can't crouch there. Normally, in real life, you would crouch behind a rock. Which way is the enemy facing? What? Whatever. This is best. Yes. We can keep going. Ow. Okay, moving out. All right. It is time to flink and spank. This is not how I want to steer the tank. They 
taking our flank. Back up. Right there. Fire! And there you go. <laughs> Anyone else want to try? Squatty don't take shit from nobody. That's right. Claude knows what I'm. Oh, you okay? The flowers. No, not the flowers. Uh. Oh, yeah. They didn't stand a chance. Come on, man. You're supposed to be commander of the Ranger Corps. A commander still has a heart, same as a foot soldier. Rank doesn't make this any less painful to see. Oh, but crying over flowers. Even little girls have bigger balls these days. Yeah. Maybe. But what matters is that their hearts... All right, I get it. Power of the heart, blah, blah, blah. Look, just go turn in your report already, will ya? Can't go get sloshed if we're stuck here on standby. Good point. I'll head to the command center. Hey, you do that. And tell the brass to send us tougher imps to fight next time, yeah? Uh, I gotta beat rank out of that. Well, it's not bad for a beginner. Prologue. Operation Northern Cross. The episode has been added. Yes. Basically, for those of you who have never played a Valkyrie Chronicles and this is the first time you've ever seen anything like this, um, it's a good game. I've only been in, in it for like, I think, 20 minutes, and so far I'm liking it. I remember playing a game back in the day called Full Spectrum Warrior, and if I learned anything from that, it was to always keep your unit in cover. Like, either standing behind a building or using something to kneel down, to crouch down behind. So, you will be seeing me actually playing a game. I would think the right way, which is always make sure that your guys are in concealment and cover and never out in the open, because that could be fatal. Especially in real life. I mean, just like real life. Yeah, I played Arma 3, so I am a Milsim gamer, so I know what I'm talking about. Alrighty, select chapter, return pages, select chapter, prologue. That was probably... what's this one? Oh, that was the mission performance. Okay, so we select this one. Basically picture it as like a World Sir, War II game. First Lieutenant Claude Wallace reporting in. Anime fiction. Well, actually... Just, just think of it as like World War II and an anime fictional world, except this is called a European Second U European War. Uh, I do know that there's the the Imperials, there's the Federation, which is what we're playing at, and there's another smaller country, which I forgot what the name was, but Valkyrie Chronicles, the first one, is what you played as. You know, you played as like the, the little country that was neutral, but got invaded and so you have to you play as like a militia group trying to fight and retake back their homeland that's been invaded by the uh, imps that these guys call them. so enough talking good work out there glad you're still in one piece we're just about to go over our next operation you're late I'm sure you know standard procedure is to report immediately after a mission. I had to piss. Oh, Minerva. You're reporting too? That's lieutenant to you, Claude. Don't get smart with me just because we share rank. 
I've got seniority. <clears throat> Sorry, Lieutenant Minerva Victor. Is it just second lieutenant or, or just lieutenant? Because he's first lieutenant. And if she's got seniority, then I guess she, I guess they're both at the same rank. I don't know. I'm not familiar with the ranking, though. But if it's anything similar to the army ranking system, then it would be like first lieutenant and second lieutenant. So I'm guessing she's second lieutenant, or maybe she's just older. <laughs> By the way, I was never in the army. I just know a lot of stuff about about the military. Because uh, I have this thing called the internet, and I am a nerd. I look up and I research stuff. Because I'm just a geek. Well, let's get started. Minerva, give us a situation report. Yes, sir. Three months have passed since we went to war. I won't sugarcoat it. They're steamrolling us. By this point, a third of our territory is under Imperial control. This is officially the crisis. If it's that bad already, we won't even be able to sustain a war effort. You're right. And the Empire's only gaining momentum. If this draws out much longer... The Federation's finished. Uh. If we fall, that's it for Europa. Nobody else could stand against them. The Empire would take total control. It'd be a fascist continent ruled with an iron fist. We can't let that happen. Europa's future depends on us. Which brings us to now. The top brass finally got off their seats and sent us a plane. A counterattack that can turn the war around in one fell swoop, ready to be put into action. What are the orders? We put all our force into one strike. Break through their defenses, and hit them where they'll hurt most. Soldiers, supplies. We'll use all reserves we have to make a final push and capture one crucial enemy base. And we lucky few of the 32nd Armored Ranger Battalion have been handpicked as the vanguard. Couldn't ask for a better mission, sir. Which enemy base are we targeting? Think bigger. We take this base, and we take their will to fight. But how could any one target mean that much to... Wait, you don't mean... You always were a clever boy, Claude. I think you've got it. Our target is the Imperial capital of Schwarzgrad. Let's fight back! Al. Operation Northern Cross. What did that board ever do to you? The year was 1935 EC. Two great powers vied to control the continent of Europa. In the east, the sun rose over the autocratic East European Imperial Alliance, a dictatorship known as the Empire. In the west, a network of loosely allied democracies banded together to form the Atlantic Federation. Both powers depended on a precious mineral, Ragnite, for their prosperity, its growing scarcity leading inevitably to war. With its overwhelming military might, the Empire captured one nation after another. While the Federation struggled to maintain unity, every battle driving them further back against the wall. Three months have passed. With seven-tenths of Europa falling to the Imperial War Machine, the Federation places all its hope in a desperate counterattack. Operation Northern Cross. Six million soldiers fought in this campaign. It claimed more lives than any other in the Second European War. Federation historians call it the Eastern Theater, but the Empire knows it as the War for the Motherland. Forward, soldiers! This is the battle you've been training for! Operation Northern Cross begins now! We'll wipe those Imperials clear off the face of Europa! Our time has come! Forward to victory! Countless soldiers fought and died on those fields, struggling to make their ideals a reality. 
Ordinary people thrust into extraordinary circumstances. I like how you can't even see their eyes. The hopes that they would see a brighter future. How can they see? What follows here is a record of those brave warriors. A record of that battle against the dark. Based on the diary of one Claude Wallace, the commander of the Federation's Gallian Squad E. Anyways, a new episode has been added. The Battle of Fort Crest. So now we'll start this one. March the 10th. Yes. At long last, we have finally entered Imperial territory. The ferocity of the Federation counterattack caught the Empire off guard. Battle by battle, town by town, we're pushing back the front, with no signs of slowing down. The road to Schwarzgrad is a long one, running at least 1,500 kilometers from friendly territory into the heart of the Empire. But at the end of it lies our target, the capital city. We have a long trek ahead of us, but for now, morale is high. Everyone here believes in this operation. Everyone is praying it'll succeed. <laughs> I guess the Empire's not so tough after all, huh, Commander? Give them one good stomping, and all of a sudden they're running off home. Huh? So are you gonna take a picture of everything we pass? Here, oh, he is a war photographer. Hey, Raz, come on! <laughs> Stop it, really! You're wasting my film! Wasting? No chance. What you got here is a picture of a future hero. <gasps> you take one too, eh, Kai? That yeah, ego is bigger than us. Uh, uh. Uh -huh. There you go. That's a keeper. Damn it, Miles! The hell was that for? Freaking hurt, Quiet. man! I told him to stop the tank. Huh? Everything okay? The wind shifted. That guy's got some pretty good instincts if he can, uh, if he can sniff out, like, enemy presence like that just by looking at the, uh, the atmosphere. They brought out the big guns. They sure did. A blast that big could wipe out a whole squad. Easy. Let's keep moving. A rendezvous point with Squad F should be nearby. <gasps> Flash. Oh. Thunder. That's the password. Next time? Give us the response before you scare us shitless. Apologies. I didn't mean to frighten you. Follow me. Lieutenant Victor is waiting. So they actually used the uh, counter call sign, I guess, from World War II, but I've only heard of it from, like, Saving Private Ryan. Who? Oh, you mean Minerva. And you are... Corporal Crystal Ward, from Squad F. Indeed, I have the honor of answering to Minerva Victor, the strongest and smartest officer in the army. <laughs> oh gosh, it's gushing everywhere. Uh... <laughs> <clears throat> I assume you saw that explosion. Yeah. Oh, we saw it all right. They must be packing serious heat. A 21 centimeter howitzer. Currently, our worst nightmare. It must have a range of at least 10 kilometers. We can't advance with that thing around. 
Just so. Our mission is to capture that cannon. All right, what's going on here? Oh, there it goes. Why do I get stuck like that? <sighs> Hope I didn't miss anything. Allow me to explain your next mission. As you know, Fort Crest has a 21 centimeter howitzer that's blocking our advance. It might just look like an old castle turned into a makeshift fort. But they've stationed quite a few troops to defend the cannon. If we get too close, those turrets on the walls will mow us down. So when does our own cannon get here? That howitzer already destroyed it. We were outranged. Blown up already? How long will the replacement take? The bridge was destroyed too, so the artillery tractor can't proceed. It will take at least seven days. Though we do have plenty of infantry en route. Doesn't matter how many foot soldiers we get. Without a cannon, we're just waiting around. Not necessarily. Huh? Time is of the essence. We don't have a week to wait. You're as sharp as ever. Like he says, we can't afford to wait. We'll have to capture the fort without artillery. That's too reckless. Those turrets would fill us with more holes than golly and cheese. It's a dangerous mission, I know. But those are your orders. This isn't your local militia. This is what you signed up for when you joined the Edinburgh Army. You're right. We enlisted to crush the Empire. Not to commit suicide. Then allow me to clue you in on something. Crystal, tell them the news. Yes, ma'am. This morning, the Empire invaded yeah, no Galia. They've... invaded? I knew it was only a matter of time. What about our hometown? Is Hoffman okay? All we know is that the battle broke out near the border, at Citadel Girlandio. The Imperial Army, however, is being led by Prince Maximilian himself. Galia's prospects look grim. Oh, damn it! Is there nothing we can do? If Operation Northern Cross goes as planned, the Empire won't have the luxury of staying on the offensive. Our only option is to complete the mission as soon as possible. Guess we've got no choice then. If our home's in the Empire's sights, then we've got to protect it! Yeah, let's do it for Galia! Oh, so they're all from Galia too. Well, I guess I guess they are related to that respect. Here are your orders. We're here to seize Fort Cre Crest House or was expecting to read. Squatly would lay siege to the castle and catch in the enemy camp. However, turrets are guarding the entrance. If you wander into the machine gun's range, they'll cut through you like carving a cake. Cut straight on gaining a foothold instead. Plaza out front with you. So this is gonna be kind of a lengthy fight. But first you'll need to get into place. Position units on the battlefield to do so, blah blah blah. Yes. 20 turns pass. Limits. Okay, so this time I get to actually reassign squad. What's that do? Squad setup. Changing equipment. Changing equipment by issuing gear to infantry and installing parts in the tanks. Customizing low ass soldiers and vehicles and da, 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 sure. So I guess let's do it Claude. What can we do with Claude? 
Guess we can't do anything with it. Poor visibility. I can see why. Alright, I think that's... That's good. Let's put some troops on standby. Now, capture that cannon! You ready? Take down the Imperial camp. Capture their heavy artillery. Squad E, move out! Close the hatch. I expected resistance, but they're tough nuts to crack. What should we do? Uh, pick them off. You are a sniper, you can do that. We can't exactly rush in and kick the door down. We'll get routed if we don't have a plan. First, we need a solid foothold. Let's capture that camp. After that, well, guess we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Weapons free. Squad E, move out. Pay attention, Claude. Your leadership skills are going to be put to the test. I thought they were put to the test in the prologue, but okay. That means getting the most out of your soldiers. Don't forget the basics. Remember, the basics is a CQC. Got it. Yeah, good point. I'll keep that in mind. I will see this through. That's a lot of enemies. Let's flank this one. Can't use grenades with them this close. There they are. Yes, I already know. I think I have it nailed down already. Okay. Well, that's good. I guess I don't have any infantry, I have to take care of can the tanks. They got you in that fight. Yes, I'm not bad. Uh, there we go. Hit that. Right there. How do you miss? How do you miss from being right there? Attention all squad. Check your equipment. Alrighty then. Him Moving again. out. I have to deploy some infantry because I have not deployed any infantry. Let's try this again, shall we? Fire! There you go. Damn, that's a no! hell of a weak point. If it could destroy it just like that, then that's a hell of a weak point. Are the reinforcements on their way? That's very useful. We're done with that, now let's start deploying. I thought we've already had some infantry. gonna tank I have hopefully not too long I got like a plate of spaghetti sitting right here oh really the tanks don't really die No, 
No, I want to select a thing. Here. There we go. Oh, it's a, I'm using up too much points just deploying reinforcements. Here comes the pain. Alrighty. Okay, moving out. I don't know if he can hit him with a coaxo or not, but no, I can't. Get this big guy up here. What are the numbers? Enemy. Let's see what the enemy does. Makes sense. Ain't that a piece of shit? Are you kidding? He walked all the way past those guys just to shoot him. Not the not the brightest tool in the shed, I guess. Hey Yes, check this out. Well, if all we ha have to do is capture, is to capture their shit, then we might have to do the same thing. So I'm gonna have to probably leave some guys behind just to just to defend. Moving out. All right. I hope your shot is really good. No, that was bad. Enemy approaching. That's like a curve bullet. This one is. Where's the tank? Okay, this one's the engineer. Put you. But I guess we'll just put you here for now. Alrighty. Now let's get on with the tank. Advancing. I can go right, I think. Take cover behind the rubble and engage the enemy. I can't go this way? No, I can't. Keep calm. Carry on. Don't stop! Fire! Defense! Commencing 
counterattack. Follow my lead. Here comes the pain. Let's push you up. Found it. I think I should be good. Where's the lantern? There you go. Right, stand up. Get your. Get you over here and shoot this big guy. There you go. And put you behind cover. And that's it. He would be dead if he was that close. Ahead and take another crack shot at that tank. There we go. There we go. Hill confirmed. Not bad out there. I remember watching Noble okay, play uh, Noble from Lost Paws play Valkyrie Chronicles, the first one. He always had trouble with. Uh, the Lancer guy always missing. I don't seem to have, the, have that problem. Can you shoot that guy? Fire. No. That is... I was gonna say, that is the worst coaxial gun ever. Yes, I know. The Lois should give you some cover. Moving out. I don't know what I don't know much I could do with the scout. I mean, I, obviously he's used for reconnaissance and whatnot, but right now I'm just going to use him as like a, a basic rifleman. stick with the whole buddy system where I'll have like a pair of guys moving up together at the same time or one at a time Leave it to me get you to stand up He doesn't really need ammo, but whatever. Now advancing. Now let's see if we can take this guy. You better make this shot. Wow. That guy is so durable, it's not even funny. Wait, she's sniper. She's gotta hang back. Understood.
uh, this guy could have had him push up along with the other team, but whatever. Oh, the enemy didn't do anything? Cool. Three kinds. Uh, Alex, the One Punch fan. Who do I have right now? Like, I obviously use the snipers. I don't think I need any. Maybe another shock trooper. Yeah, let's let's deploy another shock trooper. Hey guys, check this out. And then we'll go with a three pair combo. Can I make him? Ladies and let's see, moving out. There. Granata. Oh shit. Well, that did some damage. This is probably a stupid thing, but we'll roll with it. Okay, Get these guys up there. Man, you're a big guy, aren't you? Let's You gotta be kidding me! How do you, how do you even do that? How's that even possible? Now oh. advancing. Where's Kai? Kai, I need you to take care of something. What do we do about a mortar that big? Oh God! Yes. Thank you, Kai. No! For now on, she will be my ace in hole. Or my ace sniper. Where's the tank? Again, they don't need ammo, but whatever. And that's it. I'll end my turn. You have activated my trap card. Let's see. Can we get this over with? Yes, yeah, so there's a gate control. Okay. God, I know this is kind of a waste, because she's going to be running all over the place. Should have had to sort it out. I'll figure it out eventually. Here comes the pain. I'll get like a good, like combination of a fire team set up to where it's like I'll I'll have these guys move together as a group. But for now, this is just how it is. Take cover, me. Alrighty. I'll get this guy to move out. Check this out. Robinson and then and It's fine now, punks. Now we gotta repair the sandbags that I destroyed. Uh I 
I could say there's not much rhyme or reason to move these guys up. Okay, moving out. Let's take out that machine gun nest if we can. can we really defend Probably have to move him closer, closer so he can actually do something. Let's see what I can do. Nope. You can't aim at this guy. Fire. Oh Watch my god. Okay. Whatever. Okay, moving out. Commencing counterattack. Follow my lead. Don't fuck with Hoffman, man. Nice. Keep up the good work. Alrighty. Moving out. I need a better position. One shot, all I need. Take it, girl. Do it. Oh. Well, that was underwhelming. Whatever. Where's the tank? I don't think the tank really needs repairs right now, but whatever. Yeah. Me face. And nothing. I pretty much screwed these guys over. Time to make some money. They are so screwed over, they can't even call in for backup. Alright, Emmy, let's get you up there in the front lines with the rest of the guys. Uh, what am I going to do with you, Kaigo? I don't know where to move you, because I don't have a reason to move you just yet. Like these I'll tell you what, since this one machine gunner, wait, that is, this is one machine gunner is so durable. Let's see if you can hit, hit a shot at it. Nothing beats experience. Do it, man. Here I come. Boom! That's what I'm talking about. Old soldiers die hard. Keep calm and move on. Leave it to me. I can't take. Normally, you would be able to take cover behind this thing. I don't know why is it just sandbags. And you should be able to take cover behind this too. I don't know why. Whatever. I'm having him stay here. I guess he he won't crouch down. That's what I'm saying. Now, let's take care of this other guy. I doubt she'd be able to shoot him from there. She's got some machine. Gun. The very best out of Alrighty. So we have them all in the grass. The worst position possible. But, whatever. Maybe you could shoot this guy. What's this? Wow. He hardly even felt that. Are you hurt? That's or anything. You know what? These guys are so damn durable, I might as well just take the tank shell and shoot it directly at them. It's the only way to kill them. Do it, girl. Finish him. There. That wasn't finishing him. I think he just tickled him. Whatever. All right, fine. Let's okay, use a damn moving tank. Out. Right now, the only concern is this thing. Fire! Wow. Okay. How do you miss? 
How do you miss that? <sighs> okay, now he's gonna do something. Don't you shoot my boy Kaigo? Kaijo? Kaijo can screw you up, man. Okay then. Like for example. Actually, hold on. Kaido, can you shoot this guy up here? Let's see if you can do it. It's kind of a distant shot, but let's see if you can hit it. Here I come. Damn, man, you got some good aim with that. Have been taken out. That's the exact one I'm talking about. Well, I could move the tank up, but I want to get these guys out of the Check grass. Like, seriously, they're just laying in the grass, not doing anything. Okay, moving out. And I don't know what's gonna happen, though, but I'm gonna push the tank up a little bit just so don't I can. Stop now. Wait. They can't do anything. Can we get this over with? All right, Emmy, I got a job for you. It's terrible, I know. Commencing counterattack. Follow my lead. Take care of on tank. All right. Let's see. I'm not sure how good your aim is, but we'll find out. There. It's really bad. Whatever. What is the tank? Okay, you. I have a special mission for you. Something that's gonna help out everybody. Prepare this. Prepare this. Let's see how they like these mortars. There you go. And because we have enough here. Oops. Prepare this. Stay frosty. Engineers are very special. There. Now everybody has cover. I got this. Except for the command point, but whatever. You move up. How far can you move up, though? Can you see if we can get you up here? Yeah, boy, we got you up here. I know I've spent a lot of points. I could have just finished them off now and saved a lot of trouble. But I figure I'd give him a chance. I mean, it's just one guy. Die! See what I mean? Might as well drag this fight out a little bit longer. Because I want to make sure I get everybody in, in a good position. Actually, you know what? Screw it. Let's this. just go ahead and take care of this guy. Oops. Alright. No, actually, I want Raz to be the one. I don't want this guy to be the one. I want Zyga. Hey, Check this out. I choose Zyga. Zyga, you're gonna be the one. On you're gonna be the one that's gonna go up to this guy's face and shoot him. How's it going? Let's go. Target destroyed. And that's Very it. Good. Now you are gonna capture the flag. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And there we go. Too well fortified. Even with the camp, we can't advance like this. What do you talk about? Everything went according to plan. I think you guys can take it. This is bad, Claude. If this keeps up, they'll mow us down. Come on, let's just go all out and charge them. Better than sitting here and dying, right? 
Well, if you charge straight at a machine gun nest, you'll be die dying anyway. No, a frontal assault is way too dangerous. You have to stand back. Easy for you to say. Damn, if only we had artillery. And that's a Q4. There has to be some way through. Just hang on until I find it. Victory condition has changed to, a to any allied unit reaches the target. Enemy reinforcements have appeared. Cool. Oh, alright. So everybody just converged on us. Well, I think I'll probably stop right here, guys, and then we'll pick this mission up later. I I gotta go eat some dinner. But uh, once I'm done with that, I'll, I'll record and make another episode of this. But I think this is good for one day. All right, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. So far, I I really like it. It's really fun. I don't know why I didn't play it when the, uh, the first one came out, though. But it's sad. I hope one day that maybe uh, Valkyrie Chronicles 2 and 3 will get ported over so that we can have like a PC port or a console port or whatever so that we can play those games too. But for now, this is uh, Valkyrie Chronicles 4. Thank you for watching. Uh, make sure you subscribe. Each subscribe will help the channel grow a little bit so that uh, YouTube Senpai can notice us. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care.